well, Badger fans in our own backyard, of course, glued to their television sets. This afternoon, Fox 11's Kelly Slick is out at one of the many Badger watch parts. Kelly, uh, any excitement going on out there? Well, Drew, you know, there is some excitement, even though most of the Badger fans here at the Green Bay Distillery are feeling a little frustration. Oh, they're happy right now. We just scored a touchdown. The Badgers just scored a touchdown. And here with me right now is the Wisconsin Alumni Association Brown County organizer, Kelly Fitzgerald. And Kelly, what is this game like right now for alumni to watch? Well, considering we just scored, it's one of the most exciting things. The point of the whole gathering like this when we have functions like this is to really wrap up the whole Wisconsin spirit. And whether it's New Year's Day or any other bowl situation or game situation, it's about coming together and show what the state of Wisconsin's like and how we back our football teams, whether it's the Packers or the Badgers. We're here for one another, and win or lose, we'll always stand strong. And what is it like to watch Barry Alvarez coach again? It has to be a little bit of deja vu. Well, I was lucky enough, before we had children, uh, my wife and I went out to the Rose Bowl in 94 and 99, and it was fantastic when Barry was there. Barry's a heck of a coach. I'm glad he's on the sidelines. I'm excited for our new coach. But there's always something a little juice just to have Barry back on the sidelines. I'm hoping he gets four in a row now. Let's, let's win. And do you think that the Badgers can come back and beat Sanford? Well, I'm afraid if I say no, I'll lose my degree. So absolutely, I'm going to say yes. I mean, it's 14-7 now. It's still early. I firmly believe Wisconsin's going to win all the way. All right, thank you very much. And people are still hopeful out here that the Badgers can come back. We will have a full wrap-up of the game, along with fan reaction, coming up on Fox 11 News at 9. Live in Ash Ashwaubenon, Kelly Schlicht, Fox 11 News. All right, Kelly, thanks so much. We'll